how's it going guys Captain Chaos here so I'm going to be doing a tutorial on how to install better radiance and uh, brighter police lights all right so this is what makes my um, lights and my vehicle a lot brighter uh, so if you just follow everything that I do everything will be good all right guys so let's go ahead and start so the first thing we want to do guys we want to download these three mods real quick the first one's gonna be better radiance okay so we'll go ahead and come down here and I'll leave each one of these in the description below so you can easily find them let's go ahead and scroll down to this uh, download this file all right and once it starts downloading I download the second one so the other one's gonna be ELS increased environmental lighting 1.1 point three all right same thing we're gonna come down here hit this blue download this file okay and the next one's gonna be uh, bus taxi metro train bright lights LED signs fix 2.11 okay the reason why you have to go to another one is because the uh, better radiance uh, doesn't have a second file anymore so you literally have to find this okay so you don't have to find it because I'll leave it in the, 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 the uh, description below okay alrighty so again uh, let's go ahead and hit that download this file and we're gonna click the 2.11 right here guys alright so after those download we are going to go to our program files and we're gonna put that into our desktop uh, some some computers um, some computers are already on their desktop but mine I'm gonna to have to of course drag and drop into my uh, desktop but anyway so uh, so guys this is for can be for steam and epic users okay so I'm going to show the tutorial for epic you I'm sorry for steam users all right epic users the only thing that's different the only thing that is different is uh, your main directory so go ahead and navigate to your main directory steam users go ahead and uh, navigate to your main directory as well like what I'm gonna do right now all right so steam steam apps common and then your main directory right there right, let's go ahead and minimize that and that and once you get that done uh, let's go ahead and open up the open IV the open four okay go ahead and open that up And once it's open, go ahead and minimize that as well. So the first thing we're going to do, guys, we're going to do increased environmental lighting. Okay, let's go ahead and double click that. All right. So we're going to go ahead and put that to the side over here. And we're going to double click on increased environmental lighting. And we're going to hit brighter. Okay, we're going to double click on brighter. You see this ELS file, guys? <clears throat> we're going to put that into our main directory. So go ahead and open up your main directory. And let's bring that to the side here make sure you have a good area to where we can install this like always okay so if you look down here on your um, uh, folder here or your main directory you see you have you have this ELS file right here guys all right <clears throat> basically it's the same thing it's just this is going to override it okay it's the same thing all right so what we're going to do is we're going to drag and drop this into our main directory okay right here all right, I'm not going to put it in because I already have it in. So one, once you drop it in here, guys, it will ask you to replace. Go ahead and replace, okay? And then we're going to hit that refresh button. All right, so let's go ahead and minimize our main directory again. We can uh, exit out of that, and we can move this down here, or you can delete it, okay? Next is going to be better radiance, okay? Go open that up, and we're going to double-click on better radiance, all right, and we're going to click on better radiance, brighter day police lights. Okay, so this video settings dot dat. All right, so we're going to go ahead and minimize, or you know what, just go ahead and keep it up. We're going to open up our open four. Okay, and we're going to navigate. Uh, make sure we're on edit mode as well, guys. Okay, make sure we're on it, edit mode. <clears throat> the way uh, the way you can see that you're on edit mode if the edit bar is blue. All right. All right, guys, if you do not have it, if you go to mods and you do not have this time 64 E that RPF, 
all right you can look on the sidebar and you can find it right here guys okay time signature for e if you click on that it'll show you it will say show in mouse folder you, you're going to click that and it's going to show in mouse folder okay it it only takes a nanosecond all right guys so once you do that you can go back to your mods folder and you can see it right here below the uh, rage package file okay so once you click that go ahead and double click on that time 64 e all right and we're gonna go to levels and GTA 5 okay and we're gonna go to vehicles rpf all right guys so uh, should be right here somewhere visual settings dot that where I am you know what I went to the wrong place guys what am I thinking let's go to favorites right, let me see here there we are all right yeah I, I went to the wrong free pathway all right guys what we're gonna do guys is we're going to a different pathway okay so we're gonna go to mods all right we're gonna go to update update that RPF comment and data all right so we're gonna go to mods update update that rpf and common and data all right and there it is right there Vi uh, visual settings that data i can't believe i almost messed y'all up <laughs> all right guys so let's go ahead and just make that where it's side by side all right and make sure you follow that pathway so you're going to see your visual settings dot that right here you see how mine is not encrypted anymore so i've already installed mine already so that's why you don't see the encrypted so what you want to do guys is you want to grab this and drag it right here okay just drop it right there and, and it's gonna say I'll just do it anyway and this right here will will erase okay the encrypted will erase right there okay so once you do that go ahead and exit out of this and we go move that down here or delete it really don't matter all right so the next one okay y'all gonna to have to of course let me go ahead and uh, come over here and close all archives okay sorry wrong one let's go ahead and minimize our open four okay so please follow every instruction on this right here guys okay so we're gonna double click on the bus taxi uh, metro train okay so I can't remember which one we cannot put in or we don't put in okay so I'm, I'm gonna go ahead and just do j just follow every step all right so the first one we're gonna do, okay, the Airbus, all right. What we're gonna do is we're gonna drag and drop these into our desktop, okay. So we're gonna drag and drop Airbus right here, all right. And we're gonna hit the Metro Train. We're gonna drop it right below it. The Metro Train LEDs sign right there, and the Taxi signs too right here, okay. So you see how mine are already dark, are already like dark complected. If yours is not dark complected, don't worry about it, okay? All right, so once you got those four in on your desktop, we're going to go ahead and just exit out of this, and we're going to delete or move this out of the way, okay? All right, so now we're going to go back to open four, okay? And we're going to navigate right here, guys. So you remember the uh, Time 64 e <laughs> You remember that, guys? All right, let's go to mods. Let's go to Time 64 e guys. Oops, Time 64 e levels, and then GTA 5. And vehicles that RPF okay go to that pathway okay so the first thing we're gonna do guys we're gonna go up to this little uh, uh, search bar here okay so we're gonna go ahead and type in Airbus all right just put Airbus okay you see right here where it says Airbus dot ytd you're gonna double click that so the very first top one right here where it says Airbus all right guys sorry about that uh, just had a phone call all right, so we're going to go ahead and hit that air. Uh, the very first one here says Airbus underscore LED sign. You see how mine is already dimmed, okay? It, it's If yours is not dimmed, that's fine. So we're going to go ahead and hit this replace button right here. So the first one we're going to do, guys, is you see where it says Airbus LED sign? You're going to find the Airbus LED sign, okay? So where is it at? Right here. So you get uh, right here, guys, the Airbus underscore LED sign, okay? Make sure it's the same right here, guys, okay? So we're going to double-click that, all right? And yours should go dim just like mine, okay? And we're going to go ahead and hit save, all right? Once that's done, guys, let's go up to this uh, um, uh, search bar again, and let's go ahead and delete that so we can go back to the area, all right? So the Airbus is done, okay? Let me go ahead and delete that Airbus, okay? 
and next i think this is the one that we could not find so let's go ahead and hit metro okay all right so metro bus we cannot find so we go ahead and hit uh, delete that metro bus okay so what's next is metro train you see this metro train dot ytd okay we're gonna go ahead and double click that and we're gonna find metro train uh where is it at guys hold on real quick let me find it right here metro underscore train underscore led signs underscore one two eight okay make sure you're right there mine's already um of course dim what you're gonna do guys hit that replace button and we're going to find of course the metro train so here it is right here guys the metro train i'm gonna double click that okay and then it'll turn dim of course and we hit save all right let's do it again let's go ahead and exit all that so we can go back to the uh, area here and we go ahead and delete that metro train okay all right the last one is going to be taxi signs 2 come up to the search bar hit taxi and right here taxi.ytd and you're going to down come on the very bottom right here where it says taxi signs 2 okay see how mine's already dim mine's already been replaced so again let's go ahead and hit replace guys Right here, Taxi Science 2, and then you're going to save. All right, then we are done. We're pretty much finished. Uh, go ahead and hit File, Close All Archives, okay? Hit that Edit Mode button, and exit out of your OpenIV, and also your main directory, okay? So, uh, we go ahead and delete our shortcuts here as well. All right, guys, so that being said i will go into the game and i'll show you how the lights look all right guys welcome to the game as you can see you can see my lights that are really bright now uh, before uh, my lights were real damn i could never ever figure out why um so they're pretty bright now um so this is what you're looking for, you know look forward to when you download this uh these uh mods is they they're pretty bright and i like it too so and not only that is uh when you change the time to a uh, night they really really pop out like big time um so i really like this mod guys and again um uh thanks for watching the video and um hope you all have a good one stay safe god bless respect others guys i'll see y'all in the next lspdfr tutorial Everybody get your fucking hands up